So if you want to create a folder and a file in your code editor, the first thing you are going to do is to locate your desktop. Go to your desktop and right click. After right clicking, select new, then go to folder. You can give it any name you want. I would prefer mine to be tutorial. After doing that, you click on the enter key. Then you go to your code editor. My code editor is Sublime Text. If you don't know how to download Sublime Text, there is a link to this video to how to download Sublime Text in the description. Or you can simply click on the end screen above here. So you watch how to download Sublime Text for your PC. Then after opening your Sublime Text, you go to File, Open Folder, you go to Desktop because you created your folder in the desktop. You click Tutorial, then select Folder. After successfully doing this, the next thing you want to do is you want to create a file. So depending on the kind of file, you may have an HTML file, a PHP file, any different, any kind of file you want to create that you want to work on. The first thing you are going to do now is to hover over tutorial and you right click again, click new file and after doing that you can either press ctrl s or go to file then click save as. You can give it any name you want, you will name, give the name of your file, I want to create an html file so I'm naming mine index.html, I click on save. Then after successfully doing this now, you can see that it is clearly outlined under the tutorial folder. This is because it's inside the tutorial. When I close it, it disappears. I open it, it reappears here. So that's how to create a file. So I've created an HTML file. If I'm to create any kind of file, probably a CSS file, an HTML file, a PHP file, I have to follow this process. But if I want to create a folder inside this, my main folder, I want to create a subfolder inside this parent folder tutorial. I have to go over tutorial, right click again, then click on new folder. And let me name mine control. Then you can see that this folder is appearing inside the tutorial folder. That is because I created, I hovered over tutorial and clicked on new folder and it was successful. And it created by naming it control. So the next thing I want to do is if I want to create a file inside my control, inside my control folder, I can, instead of me hovering over tutorial, I will now hover over control, right click, click on new file, then I can either use control S or go through the long process, file, save as, then let me name this file.css. Then you cannot say that when I open my control folder, I can see the style of CSS located only inside the control. So that is the basic step of how to create a folder inside your code editor, your Sublime code editor. So please, if you've not subscribed, like and share this video. It helps us to continue doing these videos. Thank you very much.